नमस्ते स्टूडेंट टुडे वी गोइंग टू लर्न हाउ टू कन्वर्ट नॉन रिपीटिंग सॉरी नॉन टर्मिनेटिंग रिपीटिंग डेसिमल इनटू पी बाई क्यू फॉर्म हियर वी हैव एक्सप्रेस 0.3 बार इन द फॉर्म पी बाई क्यू वेयर पी एंड क्यू आर इन पीजे एंड क्यू शुड नॉट बी इक्वल्स टू जीरो लुक एट रिप्रेजेंटेशन 10.3535 कैन बी रिटर्न एज 10.3 बार 73.6 Eight four eight four eight four. Look at here. Eight four is repeating, so here six is not repeating. That number can be represent as seventy three point six eight four bar. Look at the bar is on eight four. So here we have the quotient. That means your three is repeating. So let's start. So <coughs> let x equals to zero point three bar. So here you have to multiply ten on both sides. Y ten. If look at here, if the number is single digit, then you have to multiply ten. If the number is double, two digit number after decimal, you have to multiply by hundred. If three digit decimal, you have to multiply by thousand. So here we are going to multiply by ten. Okay, this is your first, and this is your second. If you multiply ten. One three will shift this side. That is three, and this side will remain as same. Why? So why it will remain same? Because if we take one number from infinite, so it will remain as infinite. So here, the three is repeating infinitely. So here, if we take one three from that side and bring it this side, it will not affect the result. So here, it will give you three point three bar. So now. Subtract ten one from two. We get what? Subtracting one from two that means ten minus x that means nine x. And this side, if we take this one, three point three bar and zero point three bar that means it will give you zero and this will give you. Three, so it will give you three this side. X equals to three by nine, which gives you x equals to one by three. This is your answer. Thank you.